Hi there, my name is Gary Randazzo with Wildcat Sports Report and today I'm bringing you my video edition of X's and Dazzo's. We're going to look at a play that the Cal Bears will undoubtedly run tomorrow. It's something that Mike Montgomery likes to go to uh, down the stretch in both halves, specifically in the final three or four minutes or at any time when Cal is struggling and they actually need a basket. So what we have here is your standard flex setup. You got two, two wings wide, two guys on the block, you got Jorge Gutierrez at the point. Gutierrez in this play is actually the decoy. So what's going to happen here is as Gutierrez passes the ball over to Alan Crabb, in a typical flex offense, Gutierrez is basically going to pass and then he's going to screen away. Not this time. He's going to fake and then he's going to cut right down the key. Now as this is happening, the opposite low block defender is going to come up and set, which is basically a pick and pop or a pick and roll situation for himself and Crabb. And usually this is camp their uh, scoring big man. So as this is unfolding, Gutierrez is actually going to continue through the baseline. So what this is going to look like to the Arizona defense, especially this defender, the wing, is that everything is kind of flowing this way and there's, there's a lot of commotion back here in the back. So the natural reaction for the defense, especially with a guy like Gutierrez who can shoot and drive, is that this is a play to get Gutierrez a baseline jumper. In reality, though, it's an isolation, weak side for Alan Crabb. So here's what happens. The defense starts to cheat over just a little bit. This guy actually carries through to the baseline. So the key here is for Alan Crabb, if he can get that one step on his defender, he can go right into the lane, and that's two points. This actually happened three times in the Stanford game on Sunday, a game that Cal won. Now, on the fourth time they ran it, Crabb still got into the lane, but the weak side guard came in to help, and Crabb actually kicked out to this guy here who actually made the three-pointer. So they ran the play four times, they scored four times, and that's a big reason why they beat Stanford. Uh, look for this down the stretch, and if it's a close game, you can bet that an uh, X's and O's coach like Mike Montgomery is going to call this play to try to get the Cal offense going. Again, I'm Gary Randazzo with Wildcat Sports Report, and this is X's and Dazzo's.